what's going on guys welcome back to the channel in another video um did a nice little improvement to the truck over the last week or so actually two new ones but we're only gonna do a video on one today um upgraded the shocks so as i said in my review video the rough country shocks were not riding very well um went ahead and upgraded those so let me show you what i went with on this truck and why i absolutely love this setup all right guys so what we went with here is the fox 2.0 shocks um, as you can see now these springs are obviously the stock springs with the spacer that adds the the five inch of lift that i have and I eventually i will be replacing that but i will say this setup here rides very very well um, compared to the rough country shocks i'm telling you it is a night and day difference um so definitely wanted to do a video on this and let you guys know you know how much of a, a ride quality difference i experience between these two and really the biggest difference for me was in the rear um the front definitely rides well in the rear it was bouncing around everywhere with those rough country shocks um, and i think those rough country shocks were actually a lot older than i thought they were because what i had to do when i installed them was actually cut off the top um, they were rusted in there really really good so i ended up having to take a, a, a grinding wheel and cut off the top of that that shock which really sucked um, hopefully you guys want to do that too um, everything else went super smooth. I was able to install all these even with cutting them off only took me roughly about an hour and Like I said guys the ride inside the truck is night and day difference. I mean Even my fiance was like wow like this is a lot smoother like those rough country shocks I mean, I know they weren't that old, but they rode Terribly, um, I mean and they were rusted. They had to be at least a couple years old, you know being in Indiana We experienced some rust here, but um the way they rode was just, mm. and I don't want to bash them rough country because like I said in previous videos with my Jeep, they've gotten better over the years, but their shocks, I just, I, I've never had a good, good experience with their shocks. I don't know if it's the valving, the quality, I don't know, I don't know which it is, maybe a combination of both, but these Fox 2.0s ride phenomenal. And when I'm talking smoothness and how smooth the ride is, I'm talking about bumps, um, the way this handles a very rough road. We have a lot of those here in my town, so... The way this handles, you know, a very pothole filled road is way better than previous. Um, and also highway driving is so much smoother compared to what it was. I'm not feeling every single bump, every single crack in the road, um, which is a big difference. Um, and I absolutely love it. And the reason why I would recommend these shocks as the best shock for these Ram trucks is because of the bang for the buck you get. Um, so not only are you getting a fantastic shock that's going to ride well um, on these 2500s but it's also at a really good price point i got all four of these on shocksurplus.com for i want to say the final price was 699 so really not bad for a good quality shock um, and it restricts you from going into that really high price level with the reservoir shocks coilovers you know getting really deep into it and spending tons of money this is that nice medium and i like the way these ride a lot better than the bilsteins i have ridden in a truck a 2500 that had the bilsteins i like this ride a lot better <laughs> And again, you know, I've said this in previous shock videos as well, when it comes to the ride, it's really subjective. Um, so really when it comes to the ride of, especially a big truck like this with a solid axle, a lot of factors go into that. Um, you know, control arms, your, your steering, track bar, um, of course you have shocks, coils, all that. So a lot goes into the ride, but what I'll say is just this small little tweak definitely made a huge difference for me. So if you're looking for a better ride on your 2500, 3500 Ram truck, this is a fantastic option at a great price point. Um, you're not going to break the bank with these. You know, they are more pricey than a lot of the options out there, but to me, 100% worth it to have a better ride on my truck. And, you know, I've read reviews as well when it comes to towing with these Fox shocks. I've heard they do just as well um, as a stock Ram would. So um, that's good. Good sign for me because, I, you know, when it comes to towing as well, I don't do a lot of that. But it's nice to know that even if I did tow, um, wouldn't mess anything up as far as that goes. So I'm very happy with my choice and, and definitely wanted to do a review on these as well. You know, I've only had them for a couple weeks now. I will be doing a longer term review on these as well. Just giving you guys an update, you know, say at the end of this year um, for how these are still going. And another thing that will be coming here very soon is a review on these Alpharex 
headlights. Uh, just recently got these in as well. Um, spoiler alert, I am extremely happy with them. Um, but again, we'll be doing a review on that, so make sure to stay tuned here in the next week or so for a review on those. But that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Again, just wanted to do a quick little walkthrough review um, of the change I made and how happy I am with these new Fox shocks. Um, I know a lot of people are always looking to improve the ride on their trucks, um, whether it be going from stock, rough country, Pro Comp, any of those other brands, you know, I am very happy with the Fox shocks. I think you'll be very happy with the Fox shocks if you go with those. Um, and again, Shock Surplus had a great deal on these. Would definitely check them out. Um, I'll put a link below in the description. Um, I get nothing from that. I'm not sponsored by any means. So um, it's just a, a nice little plug there for you guys to get a better price on these compared to other places I've seen. So again, guys, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more truck content coming your way. Again, we'll be doing a review of the Alpha Rex headlights here in the next couple weeks. So stay tuned uh, and thank you for watching.